I think for us, the powwows were kind of relatively new in the Southwest. Yeah, so it's important for, for all of us as members of the campus community to attend cultural events like the Hajoni Days powwow. Oh, I love it so much. I think it's such a growing experience to meet different tribes. It just feels really good to grow as a person by understanding all the different shades that indigeneity comes in, all the different lenses and viewpoints that we all see the world in is um, very different. Many of our students come from areas outside the Four Corners region. This may be the first opportunity for them to uh, learn from their peers some of the cultural traditions of Native peoples and to really respect and honor that rich cultural heritage that Native students have here on campus. Our Hajoni Days powwow that following weekend was actually my first powwow I ever attended. So yeah, it was my first time at one. <laughs> We wanted the students, our native students, to get involved. To me and a few others, the best vehicle is something to do with Native Americanness. Around that time, you see a lot of native, native students going to school to be Americans mm -hmm. without the Indian attachment, the white man's way of doing things, the education, and everything else. For us, we needed an expression. We have customs, we have culture, we have, we have intelligence, we, you know, we have philosophies and various other things that, that we wanted to show. The other part of that was we wanted to reach out and draw in the non-native students to participate with us. Uh, we put it together and we call it a powwow. Hajoni Ambassador has taught me that there is something that I have to contribute and I feel like it has helped me have a place here at Fort Lewis College and not just being a student leader but being able to be the Hajoni Ambassador who is a indigenous queer person. It has given me the ability to express that. Being a first generation indigenous woman in higher education is definitely something that I'm always um, thankful for and I'm thankful for my family and all my friends at home and also I've met here that have definitely been in my journey. So as a Native faculty member here on campus I invite everyone to attend the Hajoni Days powwow to really uh, center yourself in that space in a reciprocal way uh, learn and participate and take something from that experience. <laughs>